Uh, I take great pleasure in uh, being the person who found Tim in the corporate wilderness uh, 13 years ago. And that was about the time Tim was thinking of selling his business. Uh, that led to my introducing Tim back to Marquette, to our entrepreneurship center, which was, for all intents and purposes, pretty quiet. Uh, Tim then elected to teach in our MBA uh, program. He really started, he founded the Angel Network. He really created what we now view as our entrepreneurship program at Marquette. Tim, um, looking back, I distinctively recall the first time we met, we went over to Miss Katie's diner, and I asked you, how are you qualified to teach undergraduate courses? To which you said, you're not. Uh, then you went on to say that you don't have a terminal degree, you don't have a relevant master's degree, you don't even have an undergraduate degree in business. Um, at that point I said, I like this guy. I think when uh, I think of Tim or I hear his name, it just automatically brings a, a smile to my face. He's uh, an incredible asset to the university, um, to the students, and to the community. Tim, it's been a pleasure to work with you. We brought the Graduate Certificate in Entrepreneurship to life, and you had so many students interested in entrepreneurship through the graduate classes, and only a few of them cried. One of the things that I learned from Tim Keene is that the dog has to want to eat the dog food, meaning you can create a, a product or have an idea, um, but unless there's a consumer demand for it, you're pretty much out of luck. That was one of the first things he taught me um, in our mentorship, is the dog's got to want to eat the dog food. Working with Tim at the Golden Angels Network was a truly rewarding experience. Tim involved me in all aspects of the deal flow process. Whether I become an entrepreneur, a venture capitalist, or anything in between, the guidance that Tim provided me about entrepreneurship and angel investment will prove invaluable. What I would like to say about Tim is, in all seriousness, that for me, Tim was a person who really turned a light on for me. Um, I learned more from Tim in a short amount of time than I think I've learned from anybody maybe in my whole life except my dad. Um, it, it was almost like I didn't know how much I didn't know until I knew Tim. And he's opened doors for me, he's taught me a lot, he's mentored me in a countless number of ways. and. Uh, I just don't think you'll find a bigger fan of Tim Keene than Andy Fields. It's the reason why we're all here tonight and the reason why the business plan competition has been so successful for the last 10 years is because of Tim Keene. Without his work, so many ventures would not have been born out of Marquette. And it's because of Tim that entrepreneurship and innovation are as strong as they are here at Marquette and at the Kohler Center. I often remind Tim that if you can be a great entrepreneur in the for-profit sector, you have to be even a greater entrepreneur to make it happen in a university culture. We're really trying to revolutionize how Marquette views itself as an entrepreneurship, entrepreneurial culture. And that's hard work, and we've come a long way, and I give 100% of the credit to Tim. He is, if anything, persistent, he's a pain in the butt, he's a good friend, and uh, I've come to love him and admire him. Say, Tim, for you, I went old school. Went back to the dictionary to look up the definition of retirement. Now, the first definition says the act or fact of leaving one's job and ceasing work. That's the noun version. There's a verb version of it as well. Run the GAN, start a venture capital fund, actively work with a startup, participate on numerous boards, and adjunct teach university courses. Enjoy retirement, both the noun and verb version. Tim, thanks so much for all that you've done for the Entrepreneurship Center, for our students, and for Marquette. Uh, your contribution is greatly appreciated. Thanks, Tim, for everything. And we hope you have a great time in your next new startup. Thanks. So thank you, Tim. We appreciate it. On behalf of the College of Business Administration and the Graduate School of Management, once again, 